episode three of RMG's podcast. Yay, RMG's podcast. And today's episode is going to be talking about fanboys of everything. Get out of here, Miss Skittle, fucking cocksucker. Okay, the fanboys of Call of Duty, they're freaking playing the chips and dip shooters. They're like, oh my god, Call of Duty's the best. The multiplayer sucks ass, so I don't fucking play, not that I don't play online gaming. Uh, the multiplayer sucks, it's lagging, and it's a piece of shit. And the fucking guns suck ass, too. Unless you're a freaking, fucking intervention bullshit sniper chips and dip masturbation. Get out of here. Fucking sniper idiots. And also, uh... Reason why their games on the PlayStation, Xbox, and all the great... You're playing Black Ops, you're playing millions of these games. Play something else, jeez. Like... I think Call of Duty's fucking ruining gaming. It's the fucking... The blandest first-person shooter out there in the market. Now when shooters used to be cool, like Doom and Quake, when it Software was making the games pretty awesome there. When shooters were actually tolerable, fucking fun replayability through the roof when you weren't say you weren't guilty to play a shooter you're like oh yes this is a really good game I really must buy this doesn't matter if it's FBS they want to play something different besides fucking wrestling but wrestling games were good but that's not that's not the point but the point is wrestling games suck now fucking Raw vs Smackdown series bullshit sucks ass GHQ can't make a good series I played WD12 sucks ass W13, probably mean the same bullshit, I'm not sure, but... I know that it's, that Raw vs. Smackdown series is just becoming like Call of Duty. Madden just be, is a piece of shit, too, so yeah. Uh, another point, and another, another bag of the day. A little shout-out for Fast and Furious. He actually mentioned my name in, my, in his Q&A video. Yeah, he says, says Soldier Boy sucks 19 answers and some questions. Not that he didn't reply to him. He doesn't have to reply to everyone, but... The point is, he answered my questions, he shows me the utmost respect, and he's actually what a YouTuber should be. Not a YouTuber goes around there fucking making rumors about you and telling the fucking spread it around your town or the area. Like a someone, a certain someone I know, about a fuku face skater, get the fuck out of here. But the point is that the podcast, I'm going to make another episode, I'm going to make, like, I'll make, I'll make episodes, each episode once a month. And I keep fucking, or every two weeks or so. There. When I keep making episodes, mosquitoes suck ass, they suck blood and suck cock too, so there you go. Fucking hate them. Especially in the summertime. It's like a mosquito rant and fanboy to Call of Duty, so yes. The point is, I don't like them. Get some fuck off bug spray and spray the shit out of them, and that's that. But, uh, Killer J is a man of opportunity. He's a gamer. He's not as this chips and dip elitist. It's not the fact that friggin' uh, keep bringing dirt up on our certain foe. Jeez, like, come on. Yeah, I gotta, you know, I'm gonna do another one there. Yeah, well, episodes one was just a starting of the shitty game reviewers. Episode two was what my bot was what my working boss. And episode four might be what Warpat or Fam. So yes, look out for that one, everybody. Look out for that one. Sorry for that little high-pitched voice there, but... Ah, uh, so this is just mosquitoes being pieces of shit. Call of Duty being a piece of shit shooter. Me and, me, and, me and Warpath hate on it because, you know, it's not a good game. It's not a good series. It's just... It's meh. It's meh. It's bullshit. Fucking... I think what call people at Call of Duty commentaries is ruining ruining the YouTube community. Machinima, it's okay, but why the fuck did he tell these partners? It's like they're brainwashed these partners just to play Call of Duty, and you see a game that's not Call of Duty, and you're like, finally, fuck, jeez. RMG, it's all about variety. It's not it's not the same game like twenty thousand times, like every fucking hundred comes so videos. Oh, you said we try to put up a different, review a different game, maybe revise it maybe once or twice, or whatever. Maybe do a couple gameplays on it there, and all that stuff. And Mesquite was sucking ass, and it's fanboys of Call of Duty and fanboys of everybody else. Oh my god, he's the only good reviewer on there! No, 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 there's others. There's others you can watch and support. It's just like, you know... Retro is going to do the 150th episode. It's going to have all the gamers in it. 
all the ones that were in it there, but... Retromanga is rebuilding the roster right now, trying to rebuild it and make it balanced. Because, you know, the roster's going for fucking problems, meet members, or a certain member, he acted like a fool in front of his friend, he was fucking dancing like a, acting like a clown, he's like, <laughs> But, you know, all serious aside, but, you know, you gotta have some fucking jokes in this podcast, the story's short, but. Ah, oh, fuck off, you fly. Look like a faggot. Look like you're gonna suck some dick too. Talking about a fly. I'm not talking about Call of Duty. Call of Duty fans, get out of here, jeez. Like, eh, this is a song. Those of you that are not really here, no one lives at no one will. This is about a fantasy. Playing UFC free every night. It's about gay men fighting every night. I like guys who are fighting in their fucking underwear. And uh, that's the, the Two Face, the Two Face, Two Face Market song. Ah, fuck. That's a song. Uh, ah, fuck. That's a song called "Those Reviews Are Not Real," or "Those Reviews Are Not Real." Yeah, say it longer, like. Hey, Dad. Why are you gonna go in the? She took the clothes in. Don't lock me out. Okay, that's just my dad, everybody. Okay, so, that's, uh, yeah, well, the reasons why Mark X there, or Marcus, whatever you want to call him, left, because he's acting fucked up there. He acts like a butterfuku face eater, and he's a swift fucker, too. It means he's not, he's not smart. And swift Justin and swift fucking, uh, Swift TV Gen Zero because he's a dumbass. He's like, prove to me that Sarah is a girl. Prove to me. Do we have to? Do we? Have, does someone have to beat you in the head with a fucking aluminum bat to fucking prove you that Samus is a girl? That's plain knowledge. Jeez. Fuck, you're just as a form of the irate gamer. Jeez. Irate gamer is just as bad as you. Fucking get your facts straight, Quiro. <laughs> uh, who should I make fun of now besides Come Shot Lemur? Who's uh? Two-Face Dorcas there, he's a fucking idiot. You know. He's, pro- he's like, pro to me! He's like, hey, hey, Austin, can I join Gear Gamers? Oh, uh, well, sure, um, Two-Face Dorcas. How about you join Gear Gamers and do a webcam review, me? I have no problem doing a webcam review. Let's do it half ass like I usually do with my RMG videos. It's going to be even worse. But Bobby Nice is going to carry it. I'm going to put it on YouTube and then want to do have a little disc of RMG and do it a half ass name or like, Fuck you, RMG. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Duck you, duck you, duck you, duck you, duck you, duck you. Duck you. DMG? Yeah, he spelled RMG, he spelled with a D. And yeah, this is it for RMG Podcast Episode 3. This is called Fanboys and... And Miscuas that are sucking blood and two-faced members. That's going to be Random Rants Part 21. So, it's going to go in detail in that there. I try not to talk too long. This is supposed to be eight minutes under that, so... I have one more joke to tell. If I don't think of one, I'm gonna try to think of another one there. Ah, fuck it. Let's go. NC17 Productions, will you bring you the best stuttering? Bye bye.